A new type of surgery is growing in popularity with both physicians and veterinarians. It's called cryosurgery, taken from Greek words that actually translate to icy cold handiwork. This treatment is helping doctors resolve all sorts of skin problems, including cancer. But today's modern cryosurgery is much more than handiwork. It is very sophisticated, efficient, fast, and economical. Classically, cryosurgery has used a rod or a probe to touch the lesion and freeze it. There have also been sprays that can be funneled onto a skin mass and even cotton tip application of the freezing liquid. The most modern application is high pressure liquid nitrous oxide delivered from a new handheld device, which can very precisely place high pressure gas at extremely low temperatures. Introducing this gas right onto a wart, skin tag, or even a cancerous growth can kill it quickly. This is very accurate sparing surrounding tissues and allowing the doctor to use cryosurgery in very delicate areas, such as the mouth, ears, and eyes. After the tissue freezes, it's allowed to thaw and then it's frozen again. This freeze-thaw-freeze -freeze cycle is what causes destruction in the cells. At these extremely low temperatures, ice crystals form inside the cells, which destroys them. Cryosurgery is a well-proven method and highly effective for a broad range of skin problems. One nice thing about cryosurgery is that our animal patients don't have to be anesthetized. In fact, as the tissue freezes, this mode of treatment causes its own tissue numbing, making it practically painless and bloodless. Cryosurgery devices are also very portable, making them wonderful for going from room to room in a clinic or perfect in a house call setting or even on the farm. Costs are very inexpensive when compared to traditional surgery because anesthesia and normal sterile preparation is not necessary. The doctor's time is also less as the treatment is so fast and effective. So the next time you see a suspicious growth on your pet, ask your veterinarian about the icy cold handiwork called cryosurgery.